Hey guys, what is going on? It is Lieutenant Roller Shrimp here bringing you guys another tip video for the Game Capture HD. Now, I know that some of you folks out there may not have the best computer and have the most performance. And when you're capturing live with the Game Capture HD, it may use a lot of your CPU. Now, there's one easy way to go about this. Usually, when you have your Game Capture HD running, it's playing at the bottom and it's live. Currently, what I'm doing is I'm capturing my PC on my PC on my PC. As you can see here, it's kind of an infinite loop. And I do this because the Game Capture HD doesn't actually use many CPU resources like Fraps. Now, if we go into um, Resource Monitor for Windows, you can see here that Game Capture or HD, the software, is using about 10 CPU. Personally, I don't really know what that means, but that's kind of a highish number. As you can see, Fraps, which I'm capturing with, is using even a little bit more. Now, watch what happens when I pause the real-time video. Boom. The Game Capture HD resource goes down to 1. Now, I've also tried this on Mac, and I can tell you it works on Mac as well. I have a Retina MacBook Pro that's an 8-core computer. When I'm running the Game Capture HD, it's using about 100% or about one full core. If I pause it and I pause the video, it goes down to about 30% or a third of one of the cores. And usually when I have the video playing, my fans go on and I can hear them a little bit. With the video paused, you can't hear it anymore. Now, you may notice that the s scroller is going back a little bit. This is because you're pausing the video and it's not live anymore. Even though you've paused it, you can still scroll forward, find anything you want to capture, capture it, and still make your videos. All this does is it doesn't show you exactly what you're capturing. It's not live. You'll, see, you'll be wherever you pause the video. Alright guys, uh, if this helps you, please leave this a like. Um, and if you have any more questions or anything, um, leave a comment in the comment section below. And yeah, thanks guys for watching. See you next time.